Now, th with this program, it is a relatively new scheme and it will give you the chance to specialize as either an iOS developer or an Android developer. And once, once you have done so, you could find yourself working on the next feature of Now or SkyGo. Again, you will have a dedicated boot camp in which you will attend, and it will involve learnings around major software engineering principles, soft, um, Swift and Kotlin development, iOS and Android platforms, and continuous build and integration. Now, the goal of this program is to ensure software is delivered to an excellent standard whilst working in a busy agile team where quality is the highest priority. Without further ado, our final guest speaker to talk about their own journey whilst on this program will be Marco. So let me hand the mic over to you, Marco. Thank you, Rochelle. Um, hi everyone, so I'm Marco, I'm one of the software, uh, mobile software graduates from 2021. Um, as I say, this is quite a new program and uh, so let's talk about my journey during this process. So uh, I graduated in software engineering um, uh, in June from the Edinburgh uh, University and then uh, in September I joined the Sky Software Academy. Uh, in, in a court with mobile dev devs and software devs. Then in December, we completed our bootcamp and we started our educational program with the, all the mobile devs from London and Leeds. And uh, today is my last day of the educational program and tomorrow we'll join the Sky News team in Leeds. So uh, I have a different from the other graduates, I have quite a particular experience and because I completed my studies in Italy and I worked in Italy and then I moved to UK in 2014. Uh, when I moved to UK, I decided that I want to uh, follow my passion for technology. So I decided to apply to the software engineering course at the Napier University. At that point, I had quite a big gap in my education and uh, my knowledge of technology was limited to what I learned in Italy years uh, ago. Um, at the completion of the uni degree, I uh, decided to apply uh, for the Sky Mobile uh, program. After attending an uh, inside event like this one and meeting some of the developers in, in campus. As mentioned before, the application at the beginning was quite a standard application, I would say, uh, where you fill your form with all your informations. And then uh, I've been invited to the assessment, um, Sky Digital Assessment. It was very interesting because always there was always a feedback provided by Sky where I learned some of my strengths and some of the area where I should develop better. And uh, Sky always offered the opportunity to, to develop your skills. Last year, I had uh, like, then a coding assessment. It was uh, at five exercises that were timed, and uh, there was a choice of what language to use for the first three exercises. And uh, my preference was in Java because I learned some Java during the uni. And then for two exercises, there was a choice of Kotlin or Swift, and I decided to do it on Kotlin. And uh, the final assessment center uh, was online because, you know, during the pandemic, unfortunately. So I had an interview with one of the hiring manager, and then on a separate day, we did, we I paired with a different another candidate, and we completed an Android application uh, together. And during the day, we got full um, support from two of the senior dev from Sky. So it was a very good experience. So coming to the bootcamp uh, that I started in September um, was the same bootcamp with the software dev. So I'm not going to. Uh, talk uh, much about that. Uh, the interesting part was at the end of the boot camp, we had a, a, an extra four weeks of, uh, uh, of boot camp that was just dedicated for us uh, mobile devs. And we, we had the opportunity to work on the iOS, Android, and learn some Kotlin and uh, Swift. This was a great experience. It was, it was just a small group of us, and we managed to do a, a different showcase at the end where we show to the managers uh, all the things that we learned. So uh, the educational project was probably the best part of these first six months. We formed a team with all the, dev, uh, the mobile devs from uh, the Leeds and London office. And we created this uh, very, you know, sm smaller version of the SkyGo application. This is well, a great opportunity because we learned, we, we went over some technology that they are not even yet implemented totally in Sky. So we 
we learn some skills that we will be able to bring to the team uh, once we join them. Um, so we, we worked on like uh, GraphQL, Swift, uh, uh, Kotlin, um, Jetpack Compose for Android, and Swift UI for uh, for the iOS development. Uh, we had the full responsibility the responsibility of the project uh, from the front end to the back end. Um, and then we had daily daily feedback from the senior devs, and that was fantastic because it was it's where we learned the most of the things from the, the feedback from the senior devs. Uh, you can see a small screenshot what we made uh, was great opportunity to work also with it, uh, as a team and work with the agile methodologies. We had a scrum master dedicated for our team, uh, another graduate doing a business analysis for us. So great great project. And for the future, so as I said, today is Malaste in the in the program, and tomorrow I will join my team in Leeds uh, for the Sky News. Uh, I will work on the Sky News app. So uh, mostly will be like uh, improving the user experience on the app. Uh, I've already some met some of the I already met some of the uh, my colleagues and the senior dev and the mid level dev. They are both uh, from uh, the previous graduate program. So you can see how in Sky you have the opportunity to, to learn 